Hello, this is Rafa. Welcome to another page in my homesteading diary. Let's harvest these two grow bags. I'm not seeing nothing. I don't think there's anything in there. That'll be crazy if all this time there was, unless I just let it all rot. That might be what happened, it all rotted. Oh, wait a minute. Woohoo! Look! I'm not even sure that the potatoes would actually rot in the ground just from leaving them in there too long. I don't know, is that a possibility? If you know, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you. planted these potatoes in two 20 to 25 gallon grow bags. I don't remember for sure which one it was, but these are potatoes that I just bought from the grocery stores and they started developing eyes on them and little shoots. So I cut them into like one inch sections, uh, one eye I'm per section, and I planted them in the grow bags. I was listening to what they say is the recommended spacing. So I only put three to four uh, eyes or seed potatoes per grow bag. And I see now that it can handle way more than that. So going forward, I'll put, I'll probably double that. Each seed potato will yield three to four new potatoes. So overall, I had a pretty good harvest for the little bit that I planted. The next time around, I will definitely plant more. For the grow medium, I use fertilized potting soil, sand, per perlite, mushroom compost, chicken manure, rabbit manure, and I fertilized it several times during the growth cycle. I knew it was time to harvest because all the leaves had died off and um, I waited a few weeks after that and then started harvesting. I almost forgot I did add wood ash to the soil medium also, and that was to add additional nutrients like potassium and also for pest control. So this was the seed potato.
When I started the growing process, I did what is called the healing method. I put about eight inches of soil at the bottom of the bag and then I put the seed potatoes, buried the seed potatoes in that. When the plant grew to about four to six inches, I added more soil to the top of the leaves. When they grew some more, I added more soil until I reached the top of the grow bag. This is how the potato plant looked when it was thriving. The flowers had bloomed and I actually did not have a lot of uh, pest pressure while I was growing these. Still watching? Hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Not bad for my first harvest ever. I was very excited. This channel promotes the goodness in life. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. And above all, prosper and be in good health.